Brody and Shooty here in studio. Paul, thanks for doing this. Uh, you've had such a good start to your season entirely. Uh, I know you've talked about different pitch grips and everything else. What would you say is the overarching thing of, of why this year has, has turned out so different for you so far? I think uh, just mostly my usage um, and, then, and then just pitching up a little more in the zone uh, than I have in the past. Uh, I feel like that's been a big contributor just to helping out my curveball and just keeping guys honest, kind of changing their eye levels. Um, yeah, I know Murph, Murph and I have our game plans have been have been spot on. We've been on the same page, um, you know, every single time out there. And just every time we go out, we get more and more comfortable with each other. You know, Paul, um, I'm not going to take anything away from what you're doing right now because I think it's absolutely fantastic. But I think what you're going to have more impact on is where you've come from, what has allowed you to be what you are today. Tell me how great does it feel knowing how difficult it was for you to get where you are right now and enjoying the success that you're having. Yeah, it's been it's been a crazy road uh, for me, but you know, it just just coming into camp this year, like I just told myself it was going to be different, um, and just mentality wise, just kind of just focusing on stuff I could control um, and really diving in and and looking at video and just just trying to find uh, the the safe spots uh, with with every team that I face and certain guys that, that I can go to and have success. Um, but yeah, I've, I've been just taking it one pitch at a time right now, and I feel like it's it's been working for me. Well, you got one of the lowest DRAs in the American League and a flawless win loss record so far but all that personal success aside how about today just being part of and you got enough run support but being part of the game that ended the losing skid for your team what was that like going through nine games in a row and you guys hadn't won a game in about 12 days to be done with that for right now how does that feel it's a great feeling um you know we're we're, we're well aware in there um you know that, that we've been struggling a little bit um but you know every every team goes through their ups and downs uh, you know, we, we started off the season playing really good baseball um, in the last, you know, last 10, 11-ish games. Um, you know, we've kind of fell in some funks, but, you know, all, all the attitudes in there are, are great. You know, everyone's, everyone's pulling for each other. Everyone loves each other. And uh, we're, we're just going to continue to grind. Uh, you know, every, every game, we're, we're still coming to the park expecting to win games and shake hands at the end of the day. Um, you know, and that's, that's going to be our mindset moving forward. You know, there's no better feeling than being complimented by your peers. Our resident Hall of Famer here made a statement here on the air and said, and in his opinion, that you are the best starter on this staff at this time. How does that make you feel when you hear somebody like Dave Stewart make a comment about you? You know, that, that's awesome. Um, you know, and, and in my opinion, I, I think we got five aces on this team. Um, and, you know, everyone, everyone has their day. Everyone, you know, tomorrow, Frankie, uh, Frankie's out there for us, and then Martinez, um, guy that that came came over is Sean. Um, I've heard really good things about him. He's got really good stuff. Excited to watch that. But you know, it's we're we're all in this together. Um, you know, from from the hitters, from the pitchers, bullpen. You know, we're all in this together. And you know, I wouldn't I wouldn't be able to have the success that you know I've had so far without without everybody else. Um, you know, us starters we're we're close, and you know we've. We kind of, we try to fine print stuff uh, within each other that everyone can do better with or maybe we're doing well on um, and what we see. And so it's just, it's just a big, big group effort, honestly. Paul, thanks for doing this interview and thank you for repping the 925 so well as you always have. Hey, thank you guys for having me.